great to be here. Um, the name of the company is uh, Sensoria. I'm one of the co-founders. And uh, the vision of Sensoria, based in Redmond, Washington, is a very simple one. We, we'd like to actually make the garment, sports apparel, the next ultra-personal wearable computer. So we heard from Ariana, we heard from Doug before, that comfort is an issue. And any athlete that I talk to tells me exactly the same thing. We don't want to wear anything more. We actually want to take off things. So after listening to athletes, everyday athletes, not just uh, the top tier athletes that we heard about, uh, also the, you know, the weekend warriors, as probably most of the people in, in, uh, in, in this room, wouldn't it be cool to stop wearing plastic on, around our wrists or you know, steel and just uh, wear whatever we wear anyway, socks, shoes, pants, t-shirts, and let the geeks take the technology away and inject it in this type of garments in a seamless and transparent way. What you see here is uh, what we've done on a sock. We have created three textile, 100% textile pressure sensors that are a fraction of a millimeter thick, and they are under the plantar area of the foot. There is no plastic here. It's 100% textile. I can wash it. I can put it in my... <laughs> <laughs> in, my, in my pants here right now. But the point is, we have an opportunity to take technology away and enable three things. Number one is data. You heard from Doug, I want all the data. Let me decide what to do with the data. Number two, for the less professional athletes, we need more help, right? So we need to actually have real-time feedback. So we have created an application called Sensoria Fitness App that allows you to listen to your coach as often as you want. You can also ask the coach to shut up right, <laughs> and continue to listen to your music. But the cool thing is that your coach, while you run, he can tell you, are you on cadence? Are you heel striking and creating a lot of impact forces? Can my coach start comparing 6,000 different, actually now 8,000 models of running shoes so that I can actually say, well, this is actually a better shoe for me because I run faster with this shoe. I run further with this shoe. It's time to change these shoes. But also, I generate a lot less impact forces with these shoes. And therefore, my likelihood of getting injured with these shoes is lower. Right? Think about that as a quantified shoe shopping experience. So it goes far beyond an, a coach type of experience. It's really predictive analytics on what's best for me. We're going beyond that. And, and the cool thing is that we're actually partnering with academia because we're actually creating data sets that have never been existed before. So we're announcing today a partnership with the US Army at West Point, uh, which is fantastic. Uh, they're, they have used our socks and compared our socks, our socks are $25, $25 each, just to be, just to be clear, uh, to a $75,000 Novell system. Novell is a $75,000 clinical system. It's a gait analysis system. It's a German system that the Army uses. And they found correlation. I cannot, I'm not at liberty, actually, of describing a lot more about this data, but it's actually very, very cool because there is direct correlation between a $75,000 in the lab system and a 25 bucks sock. So we can actually bring the lab outside the lab finally and see, oh, how, how come 25% of the cadets at West Point get injured in the first quarter, right? What can we do to help and actually do injury prevention and injury recovery and rehab? Uh, beyond that, what we're doing is we're actually partnering with uh, two cardiologists, two very smart cardiologists in Europe. And as Doug was saying, we've made a lot of progress in making straps go away. Right? I mean, there's no reason to wear a strap. I can put my Garmin, I can put my Polar, I can put a Sensoria HRM module here. What Doug was referring to before is HRV, heart rate variability, which is what the coach tells him, this is time to push, this is time to relax, right? It's really, heart rate is very important. We just launched a crowdfunding campaign with these two cardiologists because these two cardiologists have done something pretty amazing. They have created an algorithm based on just HRM, not, just, not ECG and EKG, just heart rate that can predict sudden cardiac arrest. So in the background, now my application can also monitor the health of my heart while I go for a long run or I cycle and call for help. And you know, in case of sudden cardi cardiac arrest, which unfortunately kills over 2,400 people in this country every year, if you get a defibrilla defibrillator to that athlete within 10 minutes, the chances of survival are almost 100%. After 10 minutes, chances of survival are very quickly becoming close to zero. So there is a lot that we can do to make wearables disappear into garments and also turn data into actionable information and eventually what we call wisdom. 
And that's what Sensoria is about. Thanks a lot.